up, everybody? We're here with a man who is making his dreams happen. All right, a lot of people who try to call their shot and they don't get it. Dominic Reyes has called his shot and he's getting it. He has been calling for John Jones, and next week he's going to fight John Jones. Would you consider this the biggest opportunity of your professional career? Oh, absolutely. Right. Um, it's like a once in a lifetime type thing for me. Yeah. Even though it might not be once in a lifetime, like I treat it like this ain't gonna happen again. Yeah. Like how like I'm, I get to fight John Jones for the title. Yeah. He's, we're technically both undefeated. And I get to go out there and show my heart to the world, man. Like, yeah. why, why are you the guy that's going to beat him? Because, you know, uh, Anthony Smith, he was going to beat him. Everyone was going to beat John. Yeah, right. Yeah. right. Why are you the guy, Dominic? It's my time, man. It's just my time. It's, it's as simple as that. I've worked my whole life for this. And whether I was in other sports or not, because I come from a football background, everything that I've done in my life has prepared me for this. And it's just my time, man. It's the, the universe. Everything's lining up. And more confident than I've ever been in any fight. I'm not really that nervous for this fight. I'm ready to just be free. Like, I've been training with all this gear on, man. I'm ready to take off the chains and just go attack this guy. Has he lost a step? Uh, I feel he's, he's lost a step or so. But really? I expect a better version of John than we've seen recently, to be honest. He knows I'm not playing around. Yeah. He knows I'm, I'm, I'm bringing it. So I know he's tr training hard for me. There are a lot of guys who come in here and when they're getting ready for a big fight, uh, they act a particular way you're acting different. You seem genuinely excited for this fight. Like, cause a lot of guys, they try to keep the energy down, right? They're just like, they're trying to stay focused. And, but you seem like you're, you're ready to go right now. <laughs> yeah. I mean. Yeah, man. I mean, it's, I embrace every moment, man. Like every moment I'm in, I embrace it. Whether I'm excited, nervous, whatever's going on, I embrace it. And it's, you, I can feel it, man. I can feel it in the air. I, I could, I like, I could almost like, I see it every, every night I go to sleep, I see it, you know, I, I, I fight this guy every night. I've been fighting him for months and it's just like, ain't nothing left to it but to do it, you know? What's the weakness that, for that John, you see? His weakness is himself. His own ego is his weakness. His, the way he sees his opponents and he ways, the way he sees the world is his weakness. I'm not those guys that he thinks that I am. You think he's underestimating you? I don't think he's underestimating me. I think he sees me. I guess underestimate, uh, it's hard to say underestimate. He just sees me as not worthy. Mm. I, and he just couldn't be more wrong. Right. <laughs> couldn't be more wrong. Yeah. How do you win the fight? Are you going to go knock him out? What are you doing to John Jones? I'm going to do whatever. Like, I'll win it however it comes. Okay. But I plan on knocking him out, though. I mean, I have the power. I have the ability. And that, that's the dream scenario, right? Knock out John Jones and become world champion, make history. But... I'll take it however, as long as my hand's raised, and I'm You're happy. So, I'm happy. so how do you prepare for somebody like John Jones, who is so good at so many different things? I mean, if John's proven, proven one thing over the years, is that he can adjust to different styles. He can, you know, he's great with the elbows. He's great on the ground. He's great with his legs. I mean, all these, he's got all these talents. How do you uh, prepare for somebody with such a, a wide skill set like that? Oh, uh, you just be the best version of yourself. At the end of the day, all I could do is be the best version of me. Um, I am, I'm aware of what he's capable of. I bring guys in to, you know, show me different spinning attacks and ta different styles and they do things differently. Um, but at the end of the day, man, it's just about being the best version of me. All I can do is be the best Dom Reyes and the strongest, the fastest, the, the most powerful, the most precise, have my game plan on point. If shit changes, he does some weird shit, then that's what it is. Like, yeah. I, I'll deal with it, I'll adjust, I'll go. Like, but at the end of the day, it's just fighting with everything I got, man. So this is, you're fighting on, I think this is probably the biggest stage in, in the UFC right now. You're fighting John Jones in Houston, main event for the title. Oh yeah. I mean, uh, <laughs> just saying that is like crazy, right? <laughs> um, do you think about that or do you try to just laser focus on John Jones just a man? He's just a guy, he's an opponent. Once we get in the octagon, it's just me and him. Or do you like, are you like kind of leaning into how big the moment is? It's pretty cool how big it is. For me, the, the bigger the stage, the better I perform. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm from a small town and I've kind of always been the big fish in a small pond. And I've kind of always, always searched for that bigger stage, bigger stage, more eyes on me, get just more. I just want more. And every time the arena's going crazy and I feel all the energy, I just soak that. it up, dude. I'm like, Oh, <laughs> you're like an adrenaline dude. Junkie. I'm just, I am, yeah. and I'm. Uh, this is the ultimate test, man. This is the ultimate test, like mano y mano, purest form of competition you could ever have. 
and I get to just prove I'm to excited the world. for you right now, man. <laughs> Honestly, um, you get, are you nervous? Do you get nervous? Well, like, of course. You're getting me nervous. Uh, you, 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 you see, like you, you, all these people, like you, John Jones well, in front of you. The people is. I love the people, man. Okay. I love the people. Uh, the, the bigger the mob gets me going. Like I call it yeah. the mob, like Gladiator Days. It's yeah, the yeah, mob, yeah. you know. I like it. The John Jones thing is, honestly, man. I used to feel like the way you guys are yeah. saying, like John is like, oh, no, no. Yeah. like I saw him bigger than life. But I met him. I saw him in the face off, and I'm like, that's it. Like he's just like a man. He's just a guy. Yeah. He's just a man. Yeah. I saw his insecurities all over him. Right. Like he's. <laughs> uh, his time's have, coming. Have, uh, have other people in the MMA community, maybe some people who have fought John, uh, John in the past, have they reached out to you to try and like be like, hey, here are some, some things I've learned trying to pass along? Yeah. Yeah, I've, I've actually got a, a ton of support from the MMA, MMA community. Um, so like I, I sparred with OSP. He fought oh, yeah, OSP. Yeah, yeah. I actually fought OSP as well. Right. But he came in to help me with this camp. Um, Tony Ferguson's reached out to me. Oh, no way. Yeah. Oh, Diego cool. Sanchez. Like a lot of guys are really pulling for me and they're giving me tips and pointers right. and do this do that but at the end of the day everything kind of circles back to be the best version of you man yeah like it all kind of i've gotten dude everybody's an expert now right yeah. all <laughs> kinds of messages <laughs> right. dude do this do this yeah, do, right. do, 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 do. Yeah. i'm like all right for sure like i've definitely watched enough film and game yeah. plan and everything but i appreciate your support but it's like like i said man ain't nothing left to it but to do it i've done all the work the work's done time to just go out there and dance